Hey guys, what's up? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. So we're going to do a reading for your immediate future. But before I do that, I just wanted to say thank you so much to you guys. Today is my one year YouTube anniversary. And I am just so appreciative for all of you who have supported me. Um, if you've watched, been with my channel for a while, um, every so often I'll do a promotional reading. Um, five dollar readings like the uh the ones i do here but i just try to make it a little bit easier to obtain so um if you would like that you can email me at my email address below um it's just three cards i'll pick up whatever comes for your highest good um i do only have a limited number of spots so i do apologize in advance if i'm not able to get to all of you but you can find that information below as well and again, I just really thank you all for your love and support. Let's go ahead and get started with the reading. Hey guys, what's up Capricorn? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. It's going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind, shit, that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with. So flip it how you need to. Also remember, it's a general reading. So just take what's yours and leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below as well. All right, media future for Capricorn. Saving up money, possibly to buy a house. I don't know, your finances are looking good as shit there. All right, media future for Capricorn. King of Cups, Page of Cups. Page of Wands, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, energy all over this. It looks like there's some type of offer. You could be dealing with a water sign. Somebody has feelings for you. And it looks like somebody, they're going to try to express that. We'll see how it's going because it, it eh, we'll see. Show me the King of Cups for Capricorn. The Knight of Cups. So this is literally this person's actions this king of cups even if you're not dealing with a water sign this is someone <clears throat> who has emotions for you and acting on those emotions it looks like this could have been um a situation that ended possibly sagittarius energy um doesn't have to be but it looks like it's something that you've uh or have has ended and you're trying to heal from or there has been doesn't have to be show me this knight of cups this is an offer, a love offer here. <laughs> Fuck, the Queen of Cups. Yeah, you love them too. It's like there's manifesting here, but there could have been gossip around a situation or somebody could have just ghosted it. You come into a place of feelings for sure. Yeah, see, somebody ignored these feelings. Like, um, almost like, I don't know, felt it could have been rejected. Maybe somebody felt like, you know, it wasn't deserved or something like that. Because with the Four of Cups, we have all these emotions here. But then it's like somebody's just ignoring them. Not moving towards them, not reaching out and grabbing it. Maybe just busy with other things going on. But it could also be shy or, like I said, feeling like somebody doesn't deserve it. Show me the Page of Cups. Because someone definitely wants to reach out here wants to come forward wow <clears throat> this is an offer of commitment for some it could be a proposal or possibly in the past someone who proposed toward to you but it looks like somebody wants to offer something committed something that's long term that's stable that you know will last that's meant to last uh this could be somebody who's in and out maybe there's an age difference because it's like the offer is here on the table um but then surrounding that with the knight of wands and the seven of swords maybe that's why you didn't or vice versa did not go for it. i mean there's you know a third party here something like that 
doesn't have to be bottom of the line or bottom line is there's feelings here and either somebody ignored it rejected it and there there may have been reasons possibly because of a third party or just somebody wasn't ready to settle down maybe always in and out in which case i don't think that has changed with the page of wands Make sure you're looking at things from all perspectives with the hangman there. Because it may have put things on hold on a pause situation, but somebody is now moving towards that. Taking some type of risk, that leap of faith. Show me this page of wands for Capricorn for the outcome. The page of wands is a very curious energy. And... There's love on both sides here, like I said, with all these emotions here. Yeah, as a result, <laughs> yeah, it could be um, any sign really, but you're kind of curious because there is love here on both sides. It's mutual. This makes you happy as shit, and it looks like you're nosediving right into it, going right for it the happiest card in the deck something here somebody these feelings these emotions this communication is going to come in quick as crap it's going to catch you off guard and it's going to make you happy as hell and aquarius libra gemini energy but it's like even if you're not dealing with that you're you're releasing some guards you're letting some guards down here uh towards this person and you're moving towards your emotional fulfillment towards your heart space so there you go just make sure you think it through look at things from all angles because sometimes this fool just um goes into things blindly without thinking on faith alone as you can see the the dog trying to pull him back so just think of things you know all the way through all right capricorn i hope this helped i hope it resonated if so please make sure you like and subscribe below if you guys would like to contact me for a personal reading that information is below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.